So, the 2015 movie trailers just keep on coming. Terminator, Star Wars, Minions, Pitch Perfect, Avengers, and now Ant-Man. I didn't get my thoughts out on the Age of Ultron trailer because of uh, reasons, but now I have a chance to break down the newest trailer for the first Marvel Phase 3 movie. Let's get right into it. So this trailer needed to come out and really get people back on board after Edgar Wright left the project at the last minute. And did it? Well, for me, more or less. This trailer has me cautiously optimistic. However, before I get into my opinions, here's what I think will happen in the movie. Scott Lang's this guy with a sick daughter. To get money for a doctor, he takes up stealing and then gets caught. That wasn't my own original thought, by the way. That's what happens in the comics, and is what appears to be happening here. Hank Pym, the OG Ant-Man, gets kicked out of his company by this guy, who will become Yellow Jacket. This guy is going to do bad things, so Hank Pym recruits Scott Lang to be Ant-Man, after cyber-stalking him for quite some time. Scott agrees so he can save his daughter. The two test out the Ant-Man tech and become friends, but then some criminals, most likely this guy, kill Hank Pym, and Scott Lang goes on this revenge streak and becomes the Ant-Man that we kind of know and kind of love. Also, this girl is the daughter of Hank Pym and the Wasp and will most likely become the Wasp. And yeah, that's basically how I think it'll play out. Now on to my opinions. Honestly, even after this trailer, the main reason I'm still excited for this movie is my trust in Marvel. They have, in my opinion, an almost flawless track record. Besides that, the stuff where Ant-Man shrinks looks cool, and those scenes could maybe even be as cool as the Quicksilver scene in Days of Future Past. Probably not though. But without that, this trailer is just kind of meh. Some generic monologue about having to be a hero. Become a hero. But she already thinks you are. Some shots of people walking and talking. Nothing really cool besides that shrinking stuff, which is a big part of it, so I guess I'll give props for that. Overall, this trailer looks neat enough, and I'm of course going to go see this movie, but it didn't really impress me as much as I would have liked it to. The Age of Ultron trailer was crazy, and this one was just kind of... Eh, it's alright. Oh, and before I go, I just want to put this out there. Movie studios. Stop making trailers for trailers. There were these 10 second videos saying, get ready for the trailer in 3 days. Seriously, just give us the full thing in one hit. So, are you now excited for Ant-Man? What did you think of the trailer? Be sure to let me know in the comments below. Thanks for watching, leave a like, and don't forget to subscribe for more videos like the one you just watched. See you next time.